Happy Friday, everybody. So this week I was talking to someone about how they could translate their military experience into the civilian job. And one of the things we were talking about is sometimes there's just, it's impossible, right? If you work on a submarine, there might not be a way to translate that into a civilian job title. So one of the other things you can do is you can actually think about things outside of work that apply. And I'll tell you what I was sharing with her. So for instance, if um, your passions, I always say, evidence after 5 p.m., right? From nine to five during the duty day, you're kind of doing what you're supposed to be doing. And then after five, you get the choice, right? You get to vote with your time, what you're passionate about. And that oftentimes can lend to a lot of energy when you're talking. So a good example was this person when I asked them, what do you like to do after work or on the weekends? And they said, you know, they love to run, that they've done a lot of charity races um, for different medical causes. And it's gotten to the point where they've been able to fundraise so much money that now they're a coach for other people. And right there I stopped and I was thinking, you know, that to me, fundraising, um, prospecting, coaching, that all indicates maybe a career in sales. And that wasn't something that she had spoken about before. Um, you know, I'm in the junior league and we do so much volunteer work. And again, fundraising is some of the committees you can be on. You can also be on committees that plan big events. And those are some of the skills that you can surface in an interview um, that are very relatable, that people understand. So when you're thinking about translating your military experience, don't just limit yourself. There's some other folks that I've been friends with that are really big in the CrossFit community and they've been um, wellness coaches and again um, starting their own businesses. I've had another friend just for fun start a blog and those are all skills that are incredibly relatable in the civilian world. So um, think outside of nine to five because I really feel like when you ask somebody what they do um, when they can vote with their time that often indicates uh, you know where their, their flow is or like their natural kind of enthusiasm for things. So see you next week. Bye.